So this is Insight video tutorial number 17 and this will be demonstrating how to add or apply first and second stage delays to uh, sanders and outputs. So where would we use the first and second stage delay? Well one area might be whereby we have a site that doesn't want to evacuate the whole site on a single smoke detector. They would like to have a, an acknowledgement period maybe of up to 30 seconds so that when a smoke detector goes into fire maybe the beacons operate immediately but the sound is delayed for 30 seconds for someone to go to the panel and acknowledge the system by pressing the acknowledgement button. This would then start the second timer which is the investigation delay and that could be maybe three to four minutes to allow someone to go across the uh, the actual site to find the activated device and to determine what the cause actually is obviously if a second smoke detector was to go into fire or indeed a call point is activated then the system goes into full evacuation so to set up the first and second stage delays we need to select the loop and then loop manager we need to select the sound bases that we require to have the first and second stage delay so it's control and shift. We're going to set up the first stage delay. Remember this is the acknowledgement period, i.e. to allow someone to get to the panel to acknowledge it. There'd just be the panel display and a fire and a local buzzer. Once they push the acknowledgement button, then we go to the investigation delay, the second stage delay. This is a time period to be able to allow someone to get to the furthest point on site to investigate what the incident might be. Press set device attributes that then sets all of these devices with the settings and now we can take a look at the actual sound bases and see if they've applied the settings so we go to our loop plop down one of our detectors select our sound base double click and you'll see that our two time periods have now been set to each of these devices that we selected for further information regarding the synchro ranger panels don't forget to check out our other video tutorials which can be found on the website at www.insightfire.com.au